Hey everyone, today I'd like to show you the steps involved with adding files to your navigation menu. It's important to note that this is a two-step process. You'll first start by adding your file to the file manager. From there, you'll be able to link your file over to the navigation menu. I'm going to say as an example that I want to add our class rules and student expectations document under About Us. My first step is I go over to the navigation menu. From here, I'm going to go to Website Admin, and it is important to note that it's from this area that we're going to find both the File Manager and the Navigation Menu module. I start with the File Manager. Once in the module, I want to choose the folder I want to add this to. In this case, I'm going to say that I want to add this under PDF. Now, I add my folder on as I normally would. I go in, I click Choose Files, I select my document. From here, I'll go in and I'll click Open. Our next two steps here are very important. I want to start first by going in and highlighting over this text. This is what is called a file path. And I want to be sure that I copy this. Our next step is also very important. And what that is, is to make sure that I go in and I click Apply Changes. Without doing this, this will not work. Once I've completed this, I'm now ready to go in and link this to the navigation menu. I start a course by going back over to the menu button, going back to Website Admin, and then from here, we'll go to Navigation Menu. From here, I want to locate exactly where it is that I want to go in and add my file. In this case, I'm going to say that I want to add this underneath the mission statement. I start by going in and clicking on the arrow. And depending on where I want this to go, I can choose either Add Link Above or Add Link Below. In this case, I'll select Add Link Below. I see I have these fields. I'll start by pasting in the file path right where it says Target URL. Perfect. From here, I'll go in and add on our title. Next, I'm going to go in and click Save. But before I do that, I want to make sure to check this box to have our document open in a new window. Now we're ready to test these changes. We want to make sure that this works perfectly. So I go in, click on the link, and I'm going to locate our new file. I see it here. Perfect. Now that we've verified that this has been added correctly, our last step to save this change is to simply go in and click Apply. Once we've done that, we can go in now. We can refresh our screen. I go over to About Us, and I see now that I've successfully added on our Class Rules document. 